When Nichols State hired their newest head football coach, it wasn't a surprise that they hired a first-time head coach. What was surprising was the guy they hired has 31 years of coaching experience. When you coach 31 years, you get some great experiences, and, and some of the moves were more, uh, you know, I don't know if it was more career-oriented or whatever, but, you know, there was always another challenge out there. Charlie Stubbs brings a pedigree that would rival most head coaches and has had him working with coaching legends like Lavelle Edwards, Mike Holmgren, and Norm Chow. And like all wise leaders, he's taken a little bit from every one of them along the way. And there's no question, you're, you know, you sit in meetings sometimes and, uh, you know, you, you see uh, decisions being made or you see techniques being taught and some of them you go, wow, that, that's exactly the way I would like to do it. So then you get in that situation where you kind of, you know, just like myself being a head football coach, you know, I'm a product of so many different guys. Coach Stubbs reminds me of a famous coach by the name of Lou Holtz. Mm -hmm. um, he's very demanding and everything. He's straightforward with everybody. He tells you how it is. Um, he's just the guy that you would want to play for. And on his travels, he's molded some pretty good players as well. How about Steve Young, Sean Alexander, and Keenan McCardell, among others? Dropping names like those certainly got his young colonel's attention. Sean Alexander was actually one of my favorite running backs at the time when he was uh, leading the league in rushing. And uh, when he told me that, I was amazed. Can't argue with the guy anything he says. Coach Stubbs is a proven, proven coach. When he told me, when he, he first got here and he told us that he coached Steve Young, I was like, Steve Young, that's the guy that played in the Super Bowl. So that's very impressive. You know, you gain more respect for those kind of coaches that's legendary. And in, in my opinion, Coach Stubbs is a legendary coach. Now, with all of his coaching experience, you might be wondering, why is he just now getting a head coach's job? Well, he's had a couple of offers on the college level, also some position jobs in the NFL. But none of those were the right fit because of his family. The Nichols job is the right job at the right time. And he's excited about being his own boss. The thing I really like the most is I control my own time. And uh, it's not like I'm lazy or anything like that, but I absolutely know what we're going to do day to day. And that's peace of mind because I've worked for some guys before. You weren't really sure what you were going to do each day. <laughs> and the man in charge is leading his offense in a whole new direction. Last season, the Colonels were an option team. This fall, footballs will be flying out of the spread offense. Um, it hasn't been overwhelming, but uh, most of the guys that's on the team, including myself, in high school, we ran spread offenses, so it hasn't been that much of a change, but it is a little different than the option offense from last season. Being in the spread, opening up the field, uh, you can't ask for much more as a receiver getting the ball in space. First of all, it's totally new, so again, you didn't have too many bad habits to break, you know, especially dealing with the passing game. A lot of new drills, a lot of new concepts for them. They've received it very well. There are certain to be some growing pains in the transition, but Stubbs says he is looking forward to the fall but added he's glad the team isn't playing San Diego State tomorrow because they are not ready. But when you waited this long to be a head coach, what's a couple more months? In Thibodeau, Paul Boron for CST Tonight.